I want to talk about why I consume four eggs every single day. Uh, I did a seminar at Exxon many years ago, and I noticed they didn't invite me back. And I called them up and I said, why can't I come back and do another seminar? Because I do a seminar series. And they said, well, you're recommending 45 eggs a day. I said, no, 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 no. I didn't say 45 eggs a day. I said four to five eggs a day, okay? And they go, oh, okay, yeah, you can come back. But generally, I will eat four eggs and sometimes only eat five eggs per day. Now, of course, uh, those eggs are not consumed at breakfast. They're actually at my first meal right around one or even two, sometimes three o'clock in the afternoon. So one of the key reasons that I consume eggs on a regular basis, uh, not only do I enjoy it, but eggs have the greatest anabolic effect, okay? Anabolic means that it's uh, turning into muscle protein or other protein. So it's building more protein in the body. I have a little scale here that shows these percentages and the type of protein. So egg, 48% of it actually turns into body tissue. And I'm not talking about even absorption. I'm talking about 48% of that egg actually turns into your body tissue. And that's pretty much the highest, not counting breast milk. Um, unless you're a baby, you're not gonna be able to get it. Now, when we take meat, fish, fowl, that's 32%, okay? Much less. And egg white is 17%, which is fascinating because that cholesterol and fat actually help in the anabolic effect. Look at soy, only 17%. It might be high in amino acids, but it does not turn into body tissue that well. Dairy, whey, this would be like cheese and uh, whey, 16%, very small. Spirulina, 6%. So if we take four eggs, comes out to 24 grams of protein, times 0.48, so 11.52 grams are actually turning in the body tissue. Look at meat, 24 grams. Only 7.68 grams of it is actually turning in the body tissue. So you're gonna to have to consume more meat to get the same efficiency as four eggs. Okay, dairy is only 3.48 grams actually turning into body tissue. So you can see that you would have to consume a lot more dairy to create this effect. Not only that, they're very high in nutrients. They pretty much have every single vitamin and mineral loaded with B vitamins, choline, healthy fats, which is right here. So it has DHA, EPA. It has a lot of the carotenoids, which is good for the eye, prevent macular degeneration. It has choline, which helps prevent a fatty liver and helps your nervous system. Now, if there's any consideration in your mind that eating eggs will increase your cholesterol, realize that there is absolutely no data that will increase your so-called bad cholesterol, LDL. It, it will increase your good cholesterol, HDL. So it is not bad for the heart. So you don't have to worry about that.